Okay, so here we are. Finally, it's arrived. It's half past seven. So, iOS 6 has now been out for an hour and a half. So, let's click the button and agree and start the download. Okay, slight change of plan. We're going to download it through iTunes instead because it just didn't update the time remaining at all. And it currently says 39, 40, 41 minutes through iTunes. So once it starts updating, I'll come back to it. Okay, looks like we're just going for the first restart. We're just coming to the end of the install. Looks like it hopefully will restart in a moment. This is going through iTunes and currently on screen it says updating firmware. And now a pop-up message has come up. Your iPhone has been updated and is restarting. Please leave your iPhone connected. It will appear in your iTunes. Ta -da. There we go, iOS 6. Update completed. Enable location services. And I'll just pause you a second whilst I type this in. Updating iCloud. Start using the iPhone. And there we go, in the bottom right corner you can see Passbook is installed, which is one of the new features. First of all, we'll just try the maps out. So here we have. Big Ben, which was featured in the keynote when the iPhone 5 was announced. We'll go into 3D mode, press the buildings. There we go. That is absolutely fantastic. It looks terrible on this iPhone camera at the moment. Here's the Houses of Parliament. That is amazing. Let's see if we can find the um, the dome, the Millennium Dome, now known as the O2 Arena. The internet's a bit slow at the moment due to everybody downloading this, but um, I'm quite happy with this, so that's really good. Okay, so there we go. 
just a final note um, Orange and T-Mobile use the same signal, they share each other's signal and can use each other's antennas if they can't get a uh, signal on their home network and they've joined together now and they're now um, called everyone everywhere or everything everywhere and if you notice in the top left corner it now says EE whereas normally it's a orange or orange with T-Mobile in brackets afterwards so that has now updated and on iTunes it came up um, updated carrier settings as well so that's something else thanks for watching and hopefully see you again soon